So as you may or may not know, these screens are scams. I am actually going to call Microsoft and confirm that this is a scam. Call Microsoft. Para soporte en español a usuarios de hogar. Presione 2. To help us to improve the quality of our products, services, and training, this call may be recorded or monitored. And information collected on this call may be transferred to other countries. Now, in a few words, tell me how I can help you today. For example, you can say things like technical support for Office 2013, help with Windows Update, or Surface support. So, computer's blocked. Welcome to Microsoft Support. Tell me help you today. Yes, I got a thing. I was surfing the internet and it said that my computer was blocked and had a bunch of viruses. Is that a scam? By the way, sir, uh, before you, uh, before I answer your question, um, I just thank you that you reported this incident with Microsoft. And your intuition is right. Microsoft will never proactively reach out to you to provide any unsolicited notifications on your computer. And any communication that we have with you must be first initiated by you. So in short, this message that you received, yes, it is clearly a scam, and that is not from Microsoft. Me on the line, and I will be doing my best here, and together we are going to get rid of this pop-up, okay? This will take for about two to three minutes minutes of your time, so let us now remove this pop-up message, okay, on your computer was, I mean on your keyboard rather, kindly press and hold control, okay. out, and delete at the same time. Okay, got it. And then you should have a blue screen, right? Yes. Please select task manager. Okay. And then, um, can you please select... Um, Rise, the browser where in you get this pop-up message. It could be Microsoft Edge, um, Internet Explorer, or Google. Can you highlight? Yes, got it. Okay, is that Microsoft Edge? Uh, yes. Okay, highlight Microsoft Edge, Ross, and then hit end task button below. Okay. Okay. And you may now close your task manager, Ross. Okay. Okay. And right now, uh, let us check whether this pop-up message is terminated or not. Can you please open a Microsoft Edge? Yep, it's gone. Okay. And what do you have on your um, screen on your Microsoft Edge? Uh, it has a bunch of, like, my feed, political, U.S., world, technology, and... Okay, so you have your regular screen. So right now, Russ, let us try to clear your browsing history so we can um, clear the unsecured website that you visited. Okay, on your keyboard again, Russ, press and hold control, shift, and delete at the same time. Got it. And then you should have clear browsing data, correct? Yeah. And below the clear button, Russ, you have there always clear this when it close the browser. It should be turned on. Okay. And then you may now hit the clear button, Russ. Okay. Got it. Okay. And tell me if you're able to see the message all clear. Yes, I see that. Okay. You may now uh, close your Microsoft Edge, Russ. Okay. And then, so that the process was that we do will take effect, I would suggest if you can restart your computer. Do not shut it down, Russ. Just a restart, okay? okay? Okay. And while we are waiting for your computer to restart, Russ, I would like to inform you that here at Microsoft Trust, we have free and paid options available to help you. And based on the information that you gave me, Russ, our free option and support is likely what you need. Since there is nothing wrong with your computer, I can definitely send you an email, Russ, and it contains articles, links that you yourself can further respond to this kind of incident. And also, 
I can re- uh, I mean, I can include here the website wherein you can report this incident directly to Microsoft. And also, it sounded less that you are a technical person. If you have a time, I can include here steps on how you can download a Microsoft safety scanner that is for free. And of course, tips on what you need to do. If you are contacted by someone claiming to be from Microsoft, okay? Okay. Okay, thank you so much. And right now, Russ, um, are, you, uh, are you done restarting your computer? Still loading up. Uh, mm-hmm. Okay. So right now, Russ, I already sent the email to you. So it will um, take for about 5 to uh, 10 minutes. So kindly uh, wait for this email, Russ. And your case number is also included in here. Okay? So right now, Russ, um, before I end this uh, call with you, I would like to uh, let you know and what you should bear in your mind that the only way or the only chance someone can take advantage on you if you let them access your computer. And given the fact, Russ, that you did not do so, I am very positive that your computer is okay and there's nothing wrong with it. Okay. So, right now, Russ, um, before, uh, I mean, uh, please don't forget to ask that my name is Lenny, and I'm the one who assisted you today, sir. I wanted to confirm, have I resolved your uh, issue right now? You can open your Microsoft Edge and see if you, uh, if it's okay. Yep, it looks to be okay to me. Okay, so um, I just wanted to confirm, Russ, have I provided you excellent service today and resolved your issue? Yes. Okay, thank you so much, Raz. Is there anything else that I can assist you with? That'll be it. Okay, thank you so much, Raz. And if you need further assistance, please do not hesitate to call us back using the case number I've sent to you. And you may have a very wonderful day, Raz. Bye for now. Thank you. You're most welcome.